Mechanical engineering is about mechanical systems. It's the design, construction, analysis and end-of-life considerations of any mechanical system. So mechatronic engineering is a field of engineering that blends um, bits of software, electrical and mechanical engineering. The program at Macquarie starts with fundamentals of physics and mathematics and builds in electronics, mechanics and software. This leads to more complicated projects in second and third year, right through to major projects where students are responsible for all levels from conception, design, and fabrication of projects, and including a senior research throughout project that links with industry and research. Now, a big driver of the industry these days is making toys and games for people, and this is all electromechanics stuff. This is all mechatronics. Um, your cell phone is full of mechatronics stuff. It's got sensors, it's got gyroscopes, accelerometers. But um, where we felt that we can make a difference is in uh, commercial devices, which are smaller, they use lower powers, things like cell phones, things like medical devices. Both the mechatronic program and the mechanical engineering program are four years long. They are both integrated engineering programs. They involve a lot of different kinds of engineering. They're both very practical programs, so you will have the opportunity as a second year student to build something that you've designed. Co courses that we do are full of professional skills. You will learn how to communicate both orally and in writing. You will learn how to be a team player, project manage, and finally to put together a fabulous tender document that will win the tender every time. Not many other unis offer mechatronics as a subject, so that was one of the things which drew it to me. In general, I really like robots. I think that they are revolutionizing how we do the majority of our industrial work and lots of production. And I think that they will make and, and continue making the world a better place as we move forward and the technology increases. The electronic side of the course I was a bit new to so that was a little bit of a stepping stone which I had to overcome but it's really quite interesting and you can really see the elements from throughout all the lectures and all the different courses that really build into um, everyday sort of industries and research and get to see it in practice. Some of the mechatronic systems we worked on were um, cars and um, other sort of Lego based robotics. So we would um, get a kit and um, it would have batteries and a few other sensors and things like that. And we would have to combine them together to create a machine which would perform a certain function. The lab facilities are amazing. We've just got a new set of labs which they are really bridging the gap from um, industry and sort of research into your more sort of student environment. The lectures and tutors throughout my entire degree have been a great help, so they're always available whenever you have problems with um, something you're doing covering in class, you're, there, you're able to go and see them for advice. They're very happy to sit down and sort of work through problems with you. So I'm combining engineering with science. I'm doing a double degree in engineering and science. Having the double degree gives me backgrounds in both the engineering and the science part. So our students will be employed in a range of destinations from the small startup where they might do a number of different types of engineering to a large corporate where they might be involved in a big team doing a big project like designing an aeroplane, being involved in construction of a large building, or producing an unmanned aerial vehicle for a drone application. So over the last two years, I've gotten to teach a lot of mechatronic students, and it's been an absolute joy. It has been so much fun to work with students, to, to teach them about, and to discover with them about this new world of microcontrollers and sensors that people are putting together in new ways and getting to interact with technology in, in a fantastic and very accessible way that's just exciting me and exciting the students in all sorts of ways. Students are coming here not having built things before and realizing that with very modest means, you can design a project, see it through from conception to completion at the end, and you don't need to be a big company to do this. One of the things I think that's so powerful about being able to see a project through from beginning to end is that we're inspiring innovative, work, innovative learning, creative learning, and we're inspiring entrepreneurs, people who can see themselves being makers, being creators. And that's something that I think our program does very well.